Hello there. My name's Tim. Welcome to my new blog. Uh, video, the YouTube blog. Video. Log. Video series. I think I'm gonna call it because the world needs another millennial with a camera who's an artist and wants you to know he makes kombucha. I also just started making my own beeswax candles because they're safe for my cat. They don't smell like anything. Okay, I think we're ready. Yeah. Yeah, we're ready. So what I'm supposed to be doing today is signing up for health insurance. And what I am doing today is playing guitar and taking my cat for a walk. Today's Simon's ninth birthday, I think. Yeah, it is. What's it like being? Oh, look at me! Come on. How does it feel being being ten years old? No, nine years old. I don't know. When I got Simon, they said he was seven years old, but he was adopted, so they don't actually know how old he is. There will be a lot more Simon in this video, in all of these videos, I'm assuming, because that's pretty much the main interesting thing about my life. But now we're going to go to my studio. Um, I'm going to take you behind the scenes in some fun things that are happening in my life in studio. Um, don't tell anyone this is a secret, but I'm making a new album, and I'm recording it right here in my own home studio. And what I'm doing now is putting some cheap foam on the wall to, to make the acoustics better. Um, but mostly it's so when I walk into the studio, I look at it and I'm like, ooh, this is like a professional place where someone should make an album. So I'm gonna do that. Look at this. They're little acoustic panelings, foam things. It's always kind of a struggle to know what to tell people when they ask me what I do for work because, you know, my main thing is I'm a musician, but some days, like today I'm editing editing a little film for Ancova Empowerment Project and I'm figuring out how to get myself health insurance. Actually, I'm mostly procrastinating that, um, but I will be doing that soon. Um, and soundproofing my studio so it's different every day. It's a trip, man. This talking to a camera thing is awfully, awfully strange. I think I just got a package. I'll be back. And I did! I think, I think it's a microphone. I think it's an Audio-Technica AT4040. so close. I'm gonna plug in my fancy new microphone so you can hear it. <laughs>
struggle. Okay, that looks right. So I'm partially doing these videos to, to learn how to, how to use my camera equipment. And also just to give you a little sneak peek into what I, what I do. Um, and to bring you along with me as I make an album, I think. I don't want to say for sure that- What are you doing, Simon? How's the mint mint smoothie exchanging? And so it's not a true story. It's called Single Girl on a Honeymoon. But every time I play it, I kind of hope that there's someone out there who it is a true story for. As I'm, as I'm editing like this video myself, while I'm filming a blog of myself, I'm realizing this is all a horrible, horrible idea. <laughs> I'm gonna keep doing it. I'm having fun. I, 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 I. This is the part of the video where I shamelessly promote that you can find my music on Spotify like this. God, this is embarrassing, but I kind of like it. In a sun-drenched dress. Maybe the important lesson from today is that the camera will choose who it wants to focus on, and that I should just accept that. But I really think I should be able to figure this out by now. Well, thanks for watching. I, I think this is the end. Maybe we'll call this the end. I'm gonna do. A cooking video next I think so so subscribe to my channel wherever you you want to do that and 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 be back <laughs> I'll learn how to talk next time most of this channel will be me drinking either wine or coffee or tea just or kombucha just so you know Seriously, right Simon. Damn. And it's a lonely night in Honolulu. But from this way of her hips, it's hard to tell.